Hey yo! Welcome back to the battlefield everyone. I'm your host Monk and we're playing Star Wars Destiny on Tabletop Simulator. We are back here with Simon from the Sith Holocron for a Padawan story. How are you Simon? I'm very well Monk, how are you my friend? Oh my god, this is happening. We've been trying to do this for this a little is... bit now. We have, it's, it's all these pesky time zones, man. Like, it's like midnight where you are, it's 8 a.m. in Ireland. The sun is actually out, which means we're probably going to die because we're Irish and people don't like the sun. <laughs> but, you know, at least it's 8 a.m. and it's sunny. That's a good thing. <laughs> That's true, man. Hey, uh, welcome so much to the battlefield, man. Like, you're one of my inspirations to have that, like, I've ever started doing this whole stuff, man. So it's really an honor to have you on. Oh man, that's I, I appreciate that one. You can I can tell you like I'm a small fish in a big pond, but um, it's I, I don't know. It's I I just love this game so much, and when I wanted to see content on YouTube, there was really only double blanks doing it really, and I thought I can do this, and it's great to hear that you kind of watched our content and went you can do it because you've got a great channel, so it's a pleasure to be here. Jim, really is. Yeah, man. Like hopefully there's a day that we actually officially meet each other, man. That'd be great. Yeah, I was I was trying my best to get the origins, but I know that's in Columbus, Ohio, and that's probably not where you are. I think you're much, much, much more west. Yeah, Cali boy here. <laughs> so, uh, but it happens, you know. Maybe, maybe worlds. We'll see. We'll see what happens, right? You never know. My plan for 2019, without fail, I will say it now: Worlds 2019. I have to be in Minneapolis. That's my goal. Oh, let's so, do it. Let's do it. So uh, my, it. my wife let's did a bet. Um, so I have to raise like 500 bucks before I can go. So so I'm really testing the limits to try to see if I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we'll, we'll save, see, save, man. save. Save, save, save. We all need to do something cool. So Yeah, we need we to get all good. get together. It should be freaking exciting. Should so, be. Really should be. So uh, I learned a little bit about you before I started this, but uh, you know maybe the Destiny community doesn't know anything about you. So can you talk a little bit about yourself? Yeah, cool. Uh, so I live in sunny Belfast in Northern Ireland uh, in Europe. That's the country that you bailed us out for during World War II. So thanks very much for that. And um, I play an awful lot of games, but this game, was shown to me in a bar in Belfast. So it's a bit like a restaurant and and a cafe all in once, but it's not really because all we do in there really is drink beer. Uh, sure. But we play games in these places. <laughs> and uh, the guy who runs it comes over and he says, you'll love this, it's Star Wars. So there's the two words that has me hooked. And until I saw the dice and went, what? What? No, What? what's that? <laughs> I thought it looked cheap. I thought it looked so cheesy. Um, and I thought, oh, please tell me it's not like, you know, magic. And he went, oh, it is. It's like a CCG. And I went, no, 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 I'm not even playing it. No, no, done magic, not doing this. And he went, just play one game. No one's playing it with me. And one game later, I bought the original Ray starter, the original Kylo starter. Oh, my God, man. <laughs> yeah, after one game, I was hooked after one game. It was just the easiest, most fun, really simple, yet really not, you know, I had no idea what I was doing. And now I have a YouTube channel. So that's the Star Wars type of thing. Other than that, man, I, I make music for a record company. That's how the bills get paid. And I get to work from home, so that's kind of cool. It isn't still bad, which gives me time to do this even when it's early in the morning. That's so awesome. No, like... That's freaking fantastic. I wish like bars over here, at least for the most part, because like not in, in central California where I'm at, we don't really have that many bars that go and be able to play board games and stuff like that. There's one just like maybe 25, 30 minutes from me, but they don't play Star Wars Destiny there. Um, yeah. But that's incredible. I'm going to move to Ireland now. So <laughs> you're more than welcome. Everyone's welcome in Ireland. We're, there you we're go. lovely, very green, very green. Don't tempt me with a good whiskey. time, Simon. Come on, man. Hey, hey, but we invented whiskey, so the whole world is welcome. There you go. Um, so what you got here today, man? What are, you, what are you facing me with? So I thought, seeing as we're going to have a bit of a creator off, um, you can play my deck I took to Euros. 
is uh, Phasma and Boba for a bit of burst and burst. Oh, yeah, you're going to put with uh, that. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, spe- specials rule. Special right. chaining rules. All right. Um, I got my own little innovation of uh, a vehicle's deck going on on my side, my friend. So we'll see how it fares, huh? Cool. I do. I do love him. I do love Wedge. That's a that's a great call. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see how well it goes, especially against this deck. All right, I'm gonna ditch well, we'll two. We'll see. I'll ditch three. Oh, that's scary. Okay. I have a lot of choices to make here. Perfect. Mm. I can't even count right now. What we got? One, uh, two. I got three. You got. You have. I got four. Your choice, my friend. I think we'll have to take that one. I would say no. All right, let's get rid of my I'd little battlefield. I'll put one. two little shields on Ezra. Yeah, he needs them. He's only a little boy. Yeah, he's a little he's boy, little be... blue-haired boy. So I'm but... going to pay two. Uh-huh. Uh-oh, here comes the shenanigans already. For an LL30. And we'll throw him out, I think. Because Boba needs to go out there. He's my favorite person in Star Wars, so... So... So you talked about uh, about getting into Star Wars Destiny. What was your first deck that you ever built? First deck I ever built: original Kylo, a Stormtrooper, and FN two one nine nine. Oh, first deck I ever built. That's brutal. And it was no man. It was brutally awful. <laughs> it was absolutely awful. I had no idea by deck construction. I was terrible. I had two copies of the ATST in it at the cost of six. Oh my gosh, man. Um, let's go so, ahead and put Hush Link right. over here. That's a great card. Okay, let's friends in low places. Yeah, see what you've got. Okay, you want easy pickings or into the garbage chute? Take that one just for a giggle. Let's roll Two good out. cards, though. Hmm. So, yeah, what, what made you go with that deck for the first time? What the one I'm playing now? No, the deck the uh, for the first one that you ever made. Uh, came to 30 points. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it came to 30 points, and I thought, oh, this is really, really good. And I didn't really have an awful lot of characters at the time. So uh, I think I had about six or seven. Uh-huh. And I predominantly play villains, mainly. Like 95% of my decks are villain decks. So that's probably the real reason why I went for it. Um, and I thought it worked okay, but, you know, it, it, it didn't. So. Yeah. That sucked. That sucked badly. Oh, I gotcha. Uh, so you talked before we uh, started and all that it takes like how long to get to your closest game store? About two hours. It's in Dublin, um, oh which is quite a wee while, quite a bit away. Is there uh, happen right, to be a store championship happening there? There hopefully is. I'm going to get rid of that. And I'm going to get rid of this one. I'm hoping so. They haven't put any dates up yet, which uh, is a bit weak. I gotcha. Uh, let me see. I'm going to do this, and I'm going to make... Three damage coming my way, huh? Three damage coming your way. Cool. Do the three and the Ezra. Okay, right, I'll go ahead and get a money. Cool. I will then. Um... You gonna do it? You gonna do it? The, uh, we'll fire that one into him like that. 
All right, I'll go ahead and do two and direct. And then, they want. Yep. Put, put out Rallyard. I'm gonna tap Rallyard. Uh, do shuffle hand and discard over here, please. And discard. Where did you want it? That's not the one I wanted. All right, and pass. You, okay. Hmm, decisions here. Oh, do you have a current uh, favorite card in the sets? Uh, not, not including Way of the Force. Not including Way of the Force. Uh, check the name. What is it? Check the name of my channel and the name of me. That is easily my favorite card in Star Wars Destiny. Wait, what? What's, Seth what, Holocron is... I don't, I don't know what you're saying. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so Seth Holocron's easily my favorite card by miles. What, what it, makes it your favorite just card? just um, The ability for free to roll out something hit a special that there's enough specials on because it was the first dice that had more than one thing on it uh -huh. the same symbol and you have a three or a four cost upgrade that you could pull back your dice resolving it yep. take your card away put it back in your hand so you didn't lose the card put this down and play it for free and if you had a resource you could rule it out that's that's horrible that's pretty good so that's horrible and your next turn, you could then play the Colocron back again. That's no, that's that's all. <laughs> I'm going to do this. I'm going to attack Mastery. All right. Two actions. Uh, and we'll throw out this young man for the first one. Nice. And two more we'll here. Yep. All right. So let's go ahead and roll out. That Ezra, you're about to kill. Seems legit. Two monies. Monies are good. They are. Monies They're pretty good. Great. They're not bad. Not bad at all. They're not bad. They're not bad. They're okay. So yeah. I'll, I'll put out lovely Phasma. Eh, uh, short. I paid two good, sir. Entangle. Get rid of this one, this one, and this one. Very, very nice indeed. Uh, oh, two very, dice. Very nice. Two dice. Two dice. This one. And I don't even know what they were on. I feel bad. So, so that was the two I hit you with. So that's. Oh, yeah, that's that. No, it's not. Yeah. So, so this... I think that was that. That wasn't a special. What was this on? And that was something. This was I a think shield. That was on that. Yeah. Yeah. So let's go ahead and get rid of that die. Oh, not a problem. All right. Right. We like it. Uh, okay. Let's have a look. Mm. I'm going to take the shield and put it on the Phasma. All right. I'll get both of these monies. Good call. Die. Yes. Do whatever you fancy do. Yeah, right. All right. So, um, all the decisions to be had here. All yep. right. So I pay Lots one. Cards. Yep. Tech team. Roll out Ayla. Ooh, Roll nice. out Wedge. So. We're talking about Way of the Force now, right? Yeah. We're waiting for this eager July 5th and or any other date for you guys out there, Ireland. What date do you think is going to be coming out over there? 27th of December. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think we'll get it a week later. That's that's what normally happens. We normally get it about a week to 10 days after you guys do. It's on the, it's on the ship. You know, it'll, it'll get shipped uh -huh. to the States and then it'll be put on the another ship and then it'll go to Europe and then it'll be on the and another then... <laughs> ship. It comes over here. So 
Yeah, a wee while. I, I'd say within a, a couple of weeks of getting it. Oh, okay. Um, let's go ahead and try to rally it. Do the same thing over here yeah. for me, please. No worries. Ding, shuffling, ding, ding, shuffling. Ding, ding, ding. This guard. Ding. Nope. That's not what I wanted. All right. Uh, let's do five indirect. Five indirect. One shield. And two there. And two there. All right. Go ahead and do decisions. Two more decisions. I love how I just mix this up. We're right there, 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 and there. All right. <laughs> um, That's cool. Let's play this. Yep. Play the one. Hawk. Nice. Think. Great die on that card. Very great die. Oh, one second. One, two. So that means one. And I'll put one here. Two. Two. Yep. Um, two more damage to Boba. No worries. And that's it for me. Cool. Oh my god. Okay. Keep so when are, uh, what card are you excited for out of all the ones that have been spoiled? Today is the 23rd of June for you and me. It is? Currently. Uh, <laughs> it is, apparently. Yeah. Um, I'm going to pay two for an X8. Okay. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool card. We'll pop that on her. And my ambush is I will rule out Boba. Dun dun dun. That's a whole lot of awesomeness right there. That is not the best roll ever. That is the best roll ever. What are you talking about? All right, let's go ahead and roll out Ayla. Ooh, special. Yeah. Yeah, let's doubt your special. You don't doubt Ayla. Two indirect damage. Ping. Uh, Ping. I'll keep this over here, to be honest. Let's go ahead and roll this guy out. Do some two damage to myself. Or a resource. Yarp. Apparently. Yeah, that, that was worth it. Yep, completely worth it. Ouch. Ooh. Yeah, that's... that's uh, you got a money too, huh? You do. I got a money too. All right, go ahead and pin down that away. That's not a bad call. That's not a bad call. Okay, I'm going to take that focus and I'm going to make that the. Let's do this. That's a two now. Okay. So you're going to make this a four and you can make him six that way. Yep. That's no buenos for me. You know what? I'll just do it. Into the garbage, shoot it. Poing. Wedge going down the garbage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no, yeah. Nobody so out of the, the, spoil, the spoiled stuff so far, uh, which one's your favorite one so, uh, that's been spoiled? Uh... Character-wise, I can't wait to play Plo Koon. I think he's... I think his ability is absolutely disgusting. Like, disgusting, disgusting. It is pretty, pretty damn good. It's not bad. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. Oh, you're not shuffle, shuffling. Shuffle, you're shuffle. passing. You're passing. You're still passing. There it is. Better. That's better. <laughs> hey! Yeah, you got a fine fighter. And let me go ahead and roll that baby out. Yeah. Another resource. Okay. Great. Okay. Let's <laughs> do the three to lovely wedgie. Great. Th thanks. Thanks, guys. 
You, you did so well here. Yeah. They're they're pretty good, aren't they? Uh, it's horrible. Um, let's go ahead and honestly, you got one resource. Hmm. Dun 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 dun. That's dun, that's dun. a dead boba. That's a dead boba. Dun, I don't dun. like that idea. So let's doubt it. You doubt the dead boba. This card, you good sir. No worries. You go, sir. Nope, your turn. You get, uh, oh, wait. Oh, yeah, this one. I doubt it. Ah, uh, you doubt it? <laughs> All right, uh, <laughs> let's go ahead and. Ooh, the decisions here. The decisions. You have no cards in your hand? I don't at all, no. I Not claim. even virtually. Good call. Turn that to a blank. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I, that was like, close. I like. All right, uh, I get three. Cool. You do. Um, wow, I'm in an awkward situation. I guess Fang Fighter, just try to kill him. Hey! Yay! That's pretty cool. Here comes That's medication. So what do you think of the meta right now? Um, I think it is starting to stale up a bit now. I think people have got to the point where we know all the characters, we know all the weapons, we know all the supports. Um, I don't think anybody's really trying to push the boat out with what we've got now, and people are too excited about mm -hmm. uh, trying to do something pretty cool. So, you know, that's that's a tad unfortunate. So it is. Um, let me have a little think about what to do here. Um, yeah, you think the seven or eight months was just too long between sets? I I think it is now. I I just think it it's it's just a shame that it's been so long, which uh -huh. is which is horrible. Um, let me see. I'm gonna put this down on the first. Oh one. no I'm way! Shoot her out. Yeah, it's going. Yeah. I had to. See ya. Okay, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Here comes the so, plasma. Let's roll. Says All loaded plasma. Loaded. So do you have loaded, any predictions? Do you have any predictions in it? Oh, that was a blanky blank. Yeah, it was. Holy moly. Uh, Feel your point. anger. <laughs> uh, see, it's why you need to be a villain. It's why you have to be a villain. Right. I flank you, good sir. This one? Cool. Oh, yeah. Good call. That special's gone. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going oh, to use yeah. take flight, and we're going to reroll these two. See what we get. Would you like to That's disrupt a bunch me? Of trash. <laughs> uh, no, but I'll take an ambush action. I'll oh, take the ambush action. Get that ambush action. And the ambush action is, I will get rid of this, and I'll reroll these three. Nice. There, it's five damage. That hurts. Yeah, that's pretty solid. Yeah, the flank though. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty solid too. But uh, but yeah. So predictions? Do you have those predictions? Do you have any? Like, I know we have For a few more the characters that we have left. Um, it's 
for Way of the Force, there there are way too many new characters. And we don't know all the cards yet because we just don't know, which is a pain in the ass, really. So um if we're talking the new one, I think that that's not the side I wanted. That's the side I wanted. There's five um, damage. I'd say there's five damage. Uh, I'd say the fifth brother is going to be immense. Like, he's just going to be brutal. Um, but only if you have him with his lightsaber. If you don't do that, it's trouble all around. Oh, yeah. uh, I think Plo, think Plo Koon's excellent. I think his ability with all the non-uniques is just ridiculous. I'm just going to keep passing on <laughs> You're just gonna keep passing. <laughs> I'll just pass. Um, I think Rex could be super interesting. Yeah. And I think new Ezra, new blue Ezra. I mean, will people give up Maz with Obi Wan? Hard to know. It's it's hard to know, but that all blue. Obi Wan and stuff could be that could be really horrible, especially with things like the new Loth Wolf card that that could be brilliant. Yeah. Uh, so I just think we're just going to get a really decent meta, and it'll probably be my main prediction is, wow. Let's that, go. That, that hurts. That's seven. That's seven damage. It's seven wow. damage. That is seven damage. You know what I have to do for that? Ready? Uh oh, he doesn't have it. He doesn't have it. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> no. I, I was literally trying to do this the whole time. Yeah, plant explosion. Oh, this is so so much fun. This is so much fun. Good game, my man. Great game. Cool. That's a good that I just love Wedge. I mean his abilities I can't believe that didn't become like a tier one thing. I, I can't believe Wedge, uh, Wedge Fagel deck didn't make it to like top table somewhere. Oh, he's no, so good. I, I really wish it did, but you know, I'm just a huge fan of using people that are using the cards that other people aren't using. So it's crazy, man. I like it. I like it a lot. Yep. Boba Phasma, though, is still a freaking beast, though. I thought you had I me think... from the get go when we first started. <laughs> That that's what this deck does. It just hits you and it hits you hard and it keeps hitting you hard. Problem is, it's as brittle as a, a glass bottle. You know, it's it's a glass glass jawed deck. My characters die, but nine times out of ten, I can kill everyone else's characters quicker. And that's exactly what happened um, at the competition. So I went, I battled five hundred, and when it worked, it worked. I did a, a, a game in six minutes. Uh huh. Uh, no game was over 15, which was great because when you're playing eight rounds of Swiss, you really want to be, be playing 35 minute games either. So, but um, yeah, so it did what it wanted 50% of the time. 50% of the time, I was saying GG, shaking hands and wanting to go to the bar. Dang, <laughs> sounds about right. <laughs> Could be worse. Yeah, that was all right. I were Irish. We, we do this as an Olympic sport. Oh, I love it. See, again, another reason why I'm going to move down. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, uh, question then. So I ask this to every single person. What is something that the Destiny community does not know about you that, that they should know? Uh, like personal stuff? Yeah, or... just like some, oh, something they don't know right now that, that you can tell them. Uh, that I'm a DJ music producer. So that's that's pretty much what I do to, to pay bills and pay rent and all that sort of stuff. So I get songs that people hear in the radio, but you can't play them in a nightclub. Uh -huh. And I work for a record label that put music in the nightclubs and they send me the song and go, can you remix this and send it back to us? And then we'll send it out to DJs around the world. So that's what I actually do for a career. So I get songs by like, um, Brianna and uh, all these amazingly phenomenally great big acts and I send them back and then if you hear songs that are, are like remixes of songs you've heard in the radio chances are it's probably one of mine that's awesome man hey again which is, which is pretty cool that is freaking amazing so what you're saying is we should get everyone to like email you or dm you or something 
for for mixtapes and stuff. That's pretty much what you're saying. Yeah, if oh, do you remember mixtapes? They were the best, <laughs> the best thing ever. You wanted to impress a girl, and you went, "I've made you a mixtape," and they would get all shy and coy and then throw it away because they didn't like the music that you liked. You know, so my heart got broken. That was back uh, in the yeah, day. Yeah, no, I mean, that, that was back in the day. That was all analog and oh, um, no. So I mean, like, you, uh, go clubbing because uh, the the company I work for is. The, the biggest dance record label on planet earth um so the chances are if you're out there and you hear a song it's probably been done by the, I both about six of us who sort of consistently remix for them so chances are it might be one of mine that you know, grooving awesome, away and you hear a hip-hop song and i've done like ll cool j and you know so so, so from like hip-hop stuff to rock stuff to all that kind of stuff and people go oh my god that's um so the first one I did was I actually got the job because I'd remixed my favorite song of all time, which was Marvin Gaye's Heard It Through the Grapevine. There we go. See? There you go. And, you know, soul classic. And you can't drop that in a nightclub with beats, but I made it so it had beats in it. And, uh, <laughs> and somebody who worked for the record company heard it, and he recorded it on his phone. And um, the rest was history. They kind of hired me right away because I was just a DJ at the time. But uh, yeah, that's how I got the job. I love it, man. I love it. But hey, thank you so much for tuning in. Truly appreciate it. Where where can they find you, Simon? Uh, all the normal social media outlets. So you can find me on Twitter at Holocron Sith. You can find me on YouTube if you like this sort of stuff. So if you were watching and you're listening, you probably do. You can find me at the Sith Holocron uh, channel. You can find me on Facebook under Sith Holocron. You can find me pretty much everywhere. We've got discords and all that other sort of malarkey. Again, it's all just under my channel name, which is on the screen now. All that stuff is going to be in the description below, guys. So if you guys are wanting to uh, go check him out, he makes a whole lot of great quality Star Wars listening content. And I highly strongly suggest that you go like and subscribe to his channel right now. Unsubscribe to me and subscribe <laughs> to Sith Holocron. You hear that? Okay. Don't no, do uh, that. I Don't truly do appreciate it, man. No, it's a pleasure, man. It's, I, I think this is one of the, the best ways we can grow this community. And it's really great to see guys who are getting uh, spoilers who kind of do stuff on TTS. I think that's awesome. I think that's so, so good. So, um, you know, like the Double Blanks got some and um, a few of the other people who kind of do TTS stuff. That's, that's awesome. That's them kind of recognizing that we are pushing their product. And telling people, and we're discussing, you know, when's the set out? We can't wait to buy the new sets. We're all waiting for new cards that we can actually physically put in our hands. And I know people who are subbed to my channel, and I'm sure it's the same for you, Monk, that people are super interested in this game and super, whether they're competitive or whether they just play for fun, there's nothing better than having the cards in your hand and the dice in your hand. And um, so it's, it's just awesome. Oh, yes. There's nothing better than you feeling that roll come out of your hand right onto the, the table. It's freaking fantastic. Unless you get double blanks. Yeah. And, and that's a whole different story. Yeah. And that's a whole different story. <laughs> <laughs> but again, thank you so much to Talagron Simon. Thank you so much for tuning in, everyone else. And I'll catch you guys next time on the battlefield. Have a good one, everyone. Peace.